Hello everybody, this is Capitalist Games, and welcome back to cross Let's Let's Build. Um, I want to give you guys a heads up, I have a rather sore throat, so um, if, you, if my so uh, voice sounds anything weird or so, that's probably going to be it. But today we're going to do a um, frame spam build using the wait, uh, Docker Cabin. If I take one out, I have a buy one of course, pretty really quickly. Was hardly anything, so that's okay. But yeah, we're gonna do a uh, frame span build, and this is gonna need you quite a lot of frames. But that's because frames have a very high health pool for their power score, and they add that health to your cabin. I mean, this build already has 570 health points with just these four parts. These are almost and only 180 points on the Dark cabin itself. That said, we're gonna use small wheels for this. Um, uh, I wanna use six wheels. Actually, I have to take a look first how, our, how this fits. Because we need to put on a two uh, that fits. So, got our little frame parts in between. As of right now, we're gonna add some more frames. Uh, actually, we're gonna need eight longs first here. Ooh, actually, let's do it like so. Since it will be much more compact. that as well. I put two eights in the front and I put two six in the rear and a four in the back. This thing is not even 1000 power score and this thing is already has over 1000 health pool. It might look <laughs> very ugly like so but it is tough and it will survive a lot of punishment. For weaponry I am gonna use a, a few shorts for a simple weaponry. I'm gonna put it on cross lines between um, in these frames, as well as a single one on the top. Or simple. And we are gonna put on a light engine in the back, as well as a weapon cooler to cool down the guns quicker. This is the only part where I'll use a bit of normal armor. It has slight issues with weight, but this thing it does have um, enough acceleration to handle it. You guys can see how long it takes. Taking out the guns is not that difficult, but... And here you can see, you guys, how long it takes to eliminate this guy. It takes ages. <laughs> but let's go into a match and let's see how well we can perform with this. We might have to use some tougher guns. Maybe a little boy instead of the uh, shorts because of course it's harder to shoot off a little boy than a short but yeah that's a big fat <laughs> son of a gun try to moment for this guy to up out I do not want to go into a group fight, this thing. Oh, there we got a guy, let's support these guys. He's 
gonna be dead anyways with these many guys here. Oh well, guess I want to kill still. Anyways, uh, let's see where we got this guy. And let's move forward. Got another guy on the left. We're gonna lose this because they are gonna cap us out. Yeah. GG. Rip. Guess that's too bad. I'm getting close to level 27 though. Which is nice. Anyway, I'm gonna look up some music again. And... I'll put it up.
Okay, guys, that was it for the music. Sorry, I did notice that uh, for a moment there was a little advertisement after the end of the first one. Uh, as you guys see, I upgraded it with the uh, little boy. It does actually work. And I'm gonna uh, give it another additional upgrade. In the form of first up, um, remove these two and add them like so. Oh, we do not. Damn it, we do not have to just storage anymore. That's how we're gonna do that. <coughs> I need to get some room underneath that. Hmm. Oh, I got a. S no, that will not work either. Either. Cause this is only a five long bottom mount. In that case, I'll just pop the generator in the back and mount this cannon up top. And of course, we're gonna need a little bit of armor around the generator. And there we go. It's a little bit overweighted now. And it's a lot of firepower score, but now you do have the <laughs> added firepower second gun. Of course, it's an option. I'm not going to take this thing into a, a battle anymore, but... Yeah, this is how I would do something like a dark cabin. Just spam the floor build, uh, spam the frame builds. Again, they're ugly, but they are pretty damn effective. I mean, you could, in theory, just... If you remove this... Here you got a frame with over 1000 health pool at six for 600 bar score. I mean, you could put a gorilla cabin on there, or actually no enhancement, and then just put on four shorts, 1800 bar score, and you could probably dominate most units in your power score. If you just fire at this cabin, start overheating with burst fire. Second overheating, it can f survive two overheatings with burst fire. If you the right out with the solo, just pure fire, uh, pure firing without letting the guns cool down in bursts or for attaining accuracy you know It's three times with four guns. I mean, it's like one third of the toughness of this, this monster. Yeah, I mean, just take a look at this frame. You can do a lot of this uh, from this frame. You usually start out with four in the force. I put two Ava Force in front, or you substitute for two 6 by 4s in the front, like so. Works fine, but you'll have to use one more part. Small wheels on here, small, uh, normal small wheels, and small steering wheels again, and just some 2 by 4s right so, like so, and then vertical. Like, I mean, uh, this way, just facing outward, so they connect up. And you've got a frame, okay, it's weight is very very high, because the frames might have a very good health to power score ratio, but it has a very bad mass to health ratio. I mean, if you look at this thing, it has uh, over four times as much weight than health, and if you can compare it, for, for example, with a Bug Gear 1, that one does not even have two times as much weight as health. I mean, this thing 
Although this thing has less health per power score, and this thing has uh, over two times as much health as per power score. Points. So yeah, these things are very tough, but very heavy. Because of that, um, the tonnage, actually, let me look. I would suggest using a WWT-1 over a uh, Huntsman, because it has better tonnage. Uh, otherwise, use a Docker Cabin. Docker Cabins are cheap as well, and you work fine with a build like this. And uh, just probably go with simple shorts or s as, uh, maybe an Avenger Cannon or a Little Boy. But I wouldn't go any further than that because well, at some point, even builds like this get their limits. You only have six small wheels. Uh, even though they are covered in armor a little bit. They're still rather easy to shoot off, so you do have to watch out for that. But that said, I want to thank you guys all for watching, and I will see you guys all later.